Today, I'm gonna test things that I found on TikTok. Oh God, it's so dark. You got me speechless. There's no way that's real. There's no way those booties are real. Whoa! It was no surprise that you guys know I love TikTok and I am on the app all the time and I see all of these amazing products, find out all of this amazing information. And there's been a few products that have been served to me that I just had to try out myself. So we're gonna try some products that I found on TikTok. And we're also gonna be following some recipes and tutorials that I also found on TikTok, if you haven't guessed. Still a little addicted. So the first one we're gonna test out is a makeup one. I already have my makeup done here, so let's rewind to Tiffy in the past. So here's the first product I'm gonna try. It's the Maybelline Tattoo Brow. It's a peel-off brow uh, color tattoo. So you apply to your brow, let dry for at least 20 minutes. Oh my gosh. I got the color medium brown. Ooh, so here it is. I'm a little nervous about this because I usually like to draw my brows on thick. So I guess I'm gonna do this pretty thick. All right, no turning back. Oh God, it's so dark. <sighs> Ooh, this stuff is so thick. I guess I should do the other one. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm gonna trust the process. I gotta wait 20 minutes, so let's go see what Red thinks. You like my eyebrows? Whoa, those are thick. <laughs> like, I don't think they're too, too dark? No, they're dark. <laughs> They're dark as night. Like, I'm just, Do you like, think that at. they show my emotion more? I mean, I think. I was just surprised. They definitely highlight your emotions this more. Yeah, but. Luckily, they're not going to stay like that. Okay. They're, they're I peel them off. They're shiny. Yeah. <laughs> I got to peel them off. Oh, you got to peel it off? <laughs> yeah. I thought they stayed like that. No, I peel them off. Oh. Okay. You're so nice. You're too nice. I was just like, uh... I can't trust anything you say. Time for the big reveal. All right, so I'm supposed to just peel it off? I don't even know how I'm supposed to... Oh, wait. It just comes off pretty easily. It's a little flaky because my freaking hairs are so thick. Oh. Okay. Hmm. I wish this line was a little more defined, but... Hmm. Do a slow zoom here. Ooh. Why do my eyebrows seem uneven? I actually like it because it's it's very subtle, you know? But it's not as dark. Hmm. Next, we're gonna try some leggings. So I saw this video and I was like, oh my, excuse me, miss. I just knew I had to try them myself. I love leggings and anything that makes my little booty look bigger, I'm all there for. <laughs> so before I purchase an item, I always have to look it up first, check out reviews. These got really great reviews. We need to talk about these pictures though. Is that how I'm gonna look? Is, is that what I'm gonna look like after buying these? Oh my God. Is that even real? <laughs> Honestly, like I can't even tell what's real anymore. I don't know if that's photoshopped or if she has implants because there's no way that is real. See, like her butt looks real. That I'm not, I don't know. I'm not so sure about. Maybe, because she looks like she has some quads. But this, I don't know. You got me speechless. There's no way that's real. There's no way those booties are real. I'm jealous. Mine does not look anything like that, so. Be prepared for my tiny little booty. All right, so here are my favorite pair of workout leggings currently. These are Gymshark. They even have the little cinched butt crack, you know, for ample illusion. Okay, they're kind of growing on me. I literally can't stop looking at my ass. Like, I think it's the fabric. It's making it look like a bubble butt. Bubble butt. Bubble, bubble, bubble butt. 
So I like the way it looked from the back, but the seam in the front, I, I could already tell it's gonna be a problem. Like, cause right when I lunge, like that seam goes straight up my butt. The seam like goes up when I lunge, major wedgie. And let me, let me ask my hubby, let me ask my husband what he thinks. I read! Hey, what do you think of these leggings? What are you gonna do with all that ass? Double cheeked up on a Thursday afternoon, hella ass. The sun is still out. Can I see him on you? He's got a red and the giant peach over here. Holding out on talking, you guys. Talking about my butt? I'm <laughs> not gonna fit those. peach is very ripe. I'm not gonna fit. No, you're gonna fit. They're very stretchy. Ready? <laughs> Ready. Whoa. Look. You look like like um silver surfer. <laughs> silver surfer. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh. Wait, let me get the right oh. angle. Oh. Let me get the oh. <laughs> What are you doing? <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Oh my god. <laughs> Do it again. Do it again. This is how it looks on my ass. On my ass. Dude, you got like big legs. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> wow. <sighs> Peachy. Dang, those look good on you, dude. Those look yeah. better on you than they do me. Let me see. Let me see this. I didn't even, I didn't even, I didn't even look that up. What the fuck? <laughs> Damn, my ass looks big. <laughs> my legs. Oh my right? god. Right? My legs, they're insane. Wow. Don't want to see the front, they're very tight. These are crazy. These are pretty crazy. Okay, I'm gonna take these off now, okay? <laughs> you, got, you got what you wanted? I got what I wanted. Okay, cool. Bye. <laughs> so I saw this thing over Christmas, hot chocolate bombs, and I just haven't had a chance to make them. So we're gonna follow a recipe. It's not that hard, it's a very simple one. Let's go up to my kitchen. Welcome to my kitchen. I don't think you guys understand how excited I am to try this. I bought these molds a long time ago, like when I first saw the TikTok and I was like, I'm gonna do this for Christmas and I never did. And I was a little sad because they were smaller than they were on TikTok, but you know what? I think I'm gonna prefer the small size. We got some hot chocolate right here. I just bought this fresh box. It's a marshmallow hot chocolate I've never tried before. We got some mini marshmallows, and then we got some good, good chocolate. This is the Girardelli good, good chocolate. I mean, it's pretty straightforward. You melt the chocolate, you put it in the molds, and then you let them dry and you put in hot chocolate. Oh! Okay, I'm gonna melt these. Let's melt them. And then we'll start, let's set out our molds and we're gonna get some, some nice shots for this. I'm so excited. I think this is good. It's a little bit thick, but I don't wanna burn the chocolate. Okay, strategy. I think you just put it in, let it settle to the bottom and then put it on the sides. This is the strategy. We're sticking to it. All right, and of course this is gonna take longer than I thought, so I'll be back when these are done. Okay, here they are, all done. That took like, <laughs> that took like 20 minutes. <laughs> okay, I'm impatient, we're gonna put them in the fridge and then we're gonna fill them up. All right. They dried pretty fast. Let's see if we could pop one out. Oh, wow. Easy, oh, that's satisfying. Oh my gosh. I think I could fill these up now, so let's see. This whole packet's not gonna fit. This whole packet's not gonna fit inside. But you don't need a whole packet. No one needs the whole packet of hot chocolate. We got extra chocolate with the chocolate. I think a tablespoon's good. So let's grab a tablespoon. Look at that tablespoon of goodness. I know these ones already have marshmallows. We're putting fresh marshmallows, so you want it to be you want it to be nice and fresh. I put them in the freezer. We're gonna wear gloves, and I'm, I have a little pan. I have a pan that's heated. All right, grab this guy. <laughs> I 
Listen, this ain't no professional bakery. I ain't trying to sell these. Okay, that's that. Well, that was a lot harder than it looked. <laughs> I have them here. They're not perfect, but they don't need to be perfect because they're gonna be in my belly. I'm gonna steam some milk. I'm gonna put those in there. Got my favorite cup. And then I'm gonna just choose the ugliest one. Ooh, oh, should I mix it? Okay, let's mix it. Ooh. It smells really good. All right. Let's see how we did. This took longer than I thought. Moment of truth. Looks good though. Mmm. Wait a minute. That's good. That's actually like perfect. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> right? All right. I think that was a success. I mean, they don't look good, right, Ruby? But they taste good. Mm hmm. Great job, babe. Thank you. Great job. And that is things that I've tried from TikTok. I love you, TikTok. Stay weird.